Nelson. It is the winner of six Tony Awards, including Best Original Score. And this weekend, Madison's Four Seasons Theater wraps up its run of The Light in the Piazza. It's a tale of love, regret, and hope. Our Michael Bruno went backstage at the Overture Center for The Light in the Piazza. On a central square, in a city made of statues and stories. So tell us about the show. The show is a wonderful show that you don't often get to see. Um, I know people are always, you know, oh, I've seen that show 20 times. No one's seen this here. It's a regional premiere. The Light in the Piazza, it's set in Italy. It's a beautiful show. The music is beautiful. The actors are fabulous. Um, it is, I would say, if you've ever been to Italy, if you have ever, ever wanted to go to Italy, if you can spell Italy, you should come and see this show. And what's the name of your character that you play in this He's show? He's a Signora Naccarelli. Ma, ma, ma. <laughs> it's a type of casting. <laughs> and, and, and what does this character do in the show? He is the father of the love interest, the boy love interest. It was high and handsome, gleaming like the crown of a king. Where would that be? Where is that? The plot concerns a woman, Margaret Johnson, and her daughter, Clara, who come to Florence in 1953. They, uh, they leave North Carolina. They feel like they, they need a vacation. And Clara is a young, innocent American girl traveling to Florence, Italy with her mother, Margaret. And she's in Italy for the first time, and she's just completely taken with it. And she winds up meeting a young, gorgeous Italian man and falling in love and the story unfolds from there. Clara, I said don't run off. Oh, uh, grazie, grazie very much. Here we go, love. You, you make this? <coughs> uh, mi scusi, uh, il suo nome? Brizio is a young Italian man, um, very virile and passionate. Uh, and he, he, he just sees Clara by chance, uh, Clara, the female lead, um, Clara by chance one day in a square in Florence and falls completely in love with her at first sight. Clara has been kicked by a horse at age 12 and she appears to be a normal 26 year old girl but she is, she's a little simple, beautiful girl and she falls in love with an Italian boy and the Italian boy's family embraces these two women, and the two kids are in love. Um, so the rest of the show is sort of about their, their really perfect love that they have together, and it's, it's kind of unattainable and unachievable, and all the relationships around them are thrown into this imperfect light because their love is so natural and pure. And the mother wants to tell them about her disability, wants to tell the Italians. She struggles with it, and eventually what she comes to is the realization that her daughter has found true love and she needs to let her go through with this, still embraced by the Italian family. It's, it's very bittersweet and beautiful and moving. So it's a beautiful Italian love story. It's a beautiful Italian love story. And do you story. have a love story, a song in your love story? I do. I sing a song with the love interest girl's mother. Uh, oh, is there a chance of falling in love there? Oh, uh, you is must <laughs> come to the show to see. You gotta buy a ticket to see the answer to that one. Tony, good luck with the show. I can't wait to see you. Thank you. The Light in the Piazza is this weekend, Friday and Saturday, 7.30 p.m., Sunday, 2 p.m. at the Overture Center. Go to overturecenter.org for tickets and Mr. Backstage himself. Joining us now, Bella Italia. Wasn't there a role for you in this show somewhere? <laughs> I don't know. I could just get a backstage with my friend Tony. I don't know. It's a beautiful production. Beautiful songs, beautiful music, beautifully sung, beautifully acted, beautifully lit. Everything's a beautiful. A beautiful. Everything's a beautiful. Four Seasons Theater takes on some pretty big productions. They do, and that's what's interesting. They take on productions that you don't normally see in Madison. This is the Midwest or the regional premiere of the show. It's a very, very little off, little uh, produced the play and they brought it to Madison. It looks like national quality. Yeah, it really is. It truly is. They're really wonderful. The or orchestra is beautiful, everything. All right. Wonderful. Coming up next week? Uh, next week, we're going to go see The Nutcracker. Oh. The Nutcracker. <laughs> the Nutcracker. Just in time for the holiday. <laughs> That's right. The wonderful ballet. <laughs> All right. Anything else? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm going to go outside and, and get suntan. Enjoy <laughs> it. Get a little cannoli. Have a little cannoli. Have a cannoli. Have a good weekend. Nice you too. Good to see you. <laughs>